we've got the band all lined up and si yeah. Simon is going to show us how to make up and get things going. Okay, well I think the first thing is I've got them in a circle. Um, that's for acoustic reasons as well as visual. I want them to be comfortable. I want them to be able to see um, everybody. I've got two mics on both guitars. Uh, a lot of times at gigs, you see only, you only see one mic on yeah. the guitar. Why, why have you got two? I've got two to give myself options when I mix. I've got this ribbon, BBC uh, microphone, patented in 1953. It has a ribbon running through it and it has a figure of eight pattern. So if I talk into it like that, I can hear myself. But if I talk into it like that, I don't because the ribbon doesn't move. So if you notice, I've got the guitar lined up. So the blind side is against the drums. So I'm going to get no drums on that. Mm -hmm. It's also f off the amp, so I've got a bit of space, a bit of breathing room, and then I've got a closer one in. So when I, with, if I blend these two together, you're going to get a sort of phasey sound, and I really don't like that. So I choose, when I mix, to use the close or the far. What does an engineer do if they can't get their hands on this sort of specialist mic? I could take all these mics down and um, use Shure SM57s for everything. Mm -hmm. I'd be quite happy doing that. It's a standard microphone? Uh, yeah, well, on, on everything I could use, you know, 70 pound microphones. <laughs> You've, you've seen a, a millions of bands, so how uh, do you think Saint Spirit did? I think they've done great. Yeah, really good. Thank you, fellas. Um, yeah, I'm really impressed.